what's going on guys welcome back to another episode of city skylines my name is sports monkey welcome back for another episode uh remember this is the sunset harbor dlc so the city skylines sunset harbor dlc and for today what we are going to focus on is the transportation system called ferries now we are going to add the ferries into our city and what we're going to do is you will need the sunset or excuse me you will need the city skylines mass transit dlc in order to create the ferry lines now the first thing we're going to do is pop back and we're going to get back and we will we are back and we have all of our information so as you can tell we have five million dollars or well, 5.3 million dollars which is a ton of money now what I want to do is I want to actually build a canal where that little river is. So what you're going to do is in order to dig up this little bit of land is you're going to, well it's actually a lot of bit of land, but anyways, um, you're going to go over to the dig tool, the landscaping tool. It looks like a shovel. We're going to press A. We're going to go hit LB and we're going to go all the way over here. What you can do is you can get a medium canal wide deep canal like we want a couple canals we do want a wide canal i don't think we really need a deep one but let's just go with the medium wide medium canal so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna follow along this river and just kind of go along it so we can add the ferry lines in and out of there you go. So now we need to wait for this to fill in with water. As you can tell, it's going to take a little bit of time, but I... Ooh, that is just ugly. Okay, I don't know if I like this. Guys, ladies and gentlemen, while I am deleting some of these lines, please make sure you please like, comment, and subscribe. Um, my last couple videos have been doing fantastic, so I appreciate the support that you guys have been giving me. You guys have been more than fantastic. Now let's keep the ball rolling and everybody from Facebook and whatever other social media, thank you guys for watching. And like I said, please smash that like button and please hit that subscribe button. We've had over 15 new subscribers in the last week. So thank you guys. I do appreciate it. And um, again, this is filling in pretty slowly. Now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to grab this tool and and I want to lower this now this is not correct see how see how this entrance to the river kind of open up for some reason we are not getting that over here so let me let me extend this out a little bit what I'm going to do is, if you guys are watching, I think I'm just going to edit it myself. Nope, I think we just got it. Nope, see, it, it's not doing... We need the opening, not the closed... Okay, that there's the opening we're looking for, ladies and gentlemen. There we go. All right, so now we have the opening to our canal, and it's not just like it's blocked off. So now we're just waiting on water. And here it comes. Do, 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 do. Anyways, that was five minutes of your life. You won't get back. Anyways, now let's create the ferry lines. So what you need to do is, again, you need the city skylines mass transit. And you're going to click A on transport. And you have here, you have a bunch of ships. So you can ha you have a harbor. You have cargo. We can't use... In this, in this, on this map, we can't use cargo hub. We can't use cargo harbor. We can't use... The harbor because guess what we do not have an ocean line to connect to at all in this map so what we have to do so that's actually kind of also why i created that canal so we can get boats to go from this side of the map to the other side anyways the, one of the first things you have to do when building ferries you need what's called a ferry depot now i'm going to put the ferry depot kind of out here you really it really doesn't matter where you place it because this is where you're getting this is where your ferries are coming from so remember when you build a bus depot you get um you know you get that's where the buses come from and that's where they you know that's where they that's where your buses come from so f with the ferry depot it's literally the same principle except you're getting ferry boats out of it 
So that is, I know it's very simple, but um, some people actually, um, the new, I've had some people that are new to this game that actually don't know it, know, know that you can do that. So just giving everybody that heads up on how to build a fairy depot. Now the next part is, is you have to build some fairy stops. Now how's this doing over here? Oh God, we're, we have some flooding, but that should take care of itself relatively soon. Anyways. We're going to stick to over here um, on this side before we expand any further. So what I want to do is you have your options are a fairy stop or a fairy pier. Now there is also if you go to the new Sunset Harbor DLC. Um, like the basically it is the public transportation hubs. You can actually find one with it is called the Ferry and bus exchange stop. So I actually kind of do want that. And we're going to put it over here. So this is kind of a bigger ferry stop. Obviously, you can see the bus, the buses, the uh, bus stops. So we have that. So that's really cool. Now we want to build other ferry lines around here. So we're going to go back to the ferries. And we're actually going to build a couple piers. So I actually want one. I, I don't know if I, I don't need a big one there. I, I just need a small one in this neighborhood. So we will connect that right now. So I, I honestly, I so I hope I don't forget. <laughs> so we will connect that right now. I am gonna put some small industry, small commercial over here, just because, you know, it is a pier, and you know, there's probably some businesses near the pier, and it's just light industrial, so it's nothing too crazy. Now we have one stop here. We have one stop over here, and I do want. Wow. We, well, okay, good stuff. I all I did was add that. Huh. Well, at least we added the canals, and the canals, the canals have water. <laughs> so this eventually will uh, kind of go away as every everything will go downstream. But that is kind of a shocker. Anyways, um, I do want to add another here over here um, we are gonna extend the city center over here so I mean it is kind of hard to see the shoreline but let's see if they will allow me to add it no yeah they, they're allowing me to add so we're gonna put another one over here because we're gonna eventually what's gonna happen over here is we're gonna extend out the city center so that's that I know so right now I know it looks a little weird but eventually it will be okay because the city center We'll come out here. Oh, great. And that's on water. Well, we're waiting. We need to wait for that to clear up. Anyways, when you're building a canal, this is what happens. Flooding. And eventually, it will go away. As you can tell over here, it already has gone away. It just takes a little bit of time. Now, I do want to add a couple ferry lines over here. Also, the only issue I have is I can't get under that bridge i've already tried <laughs> yeah i know i've already tried this so i can't get under that bridge now i do want to all right i, I do want to put a ferry line right where right there but i do want to i need to move this water tower real quick and my game is saving so good stuff now let's just make sure we add and connect this up Yep, we'll be fine. Okay, so let's add the ferry line over here. There we go. We will add our our lovely road over here. I think we can connect it right there. That's a good idea. Yep. And again, I'm going to put some light commercial over here. Oh no, you dummy. I just deleted one squeeze up. That one blue square. Or green square, rather. Alright, we'll put our light commercial over here near our... Near our pier. Now, I do want to put another one kind of over here also. I just need to figure out where. I think right here is a good spot because it's pretty wide open. And there is that... And we'll just leave that. Actually, we'll connect that right along there. Now, 
The one thing we do have, remember that the boat depot is on the other side of this canal system. So the real question is, is can we get boats from the depot to over here? Now we're gonna, tr what you have to do is build the ferry lines that need to connect. So let's first of all, build the ferry lines on this side. Then we'll worry about the other side in a couple minutes. I already tested all these bridges and what in the world is wrong with city skylines right now? Okay, I tested all these bridges beforehand. There it goes. Okay, see, I wasn't too crazy. Okay, I feel better about myself. There's that. Alright, so we connected the depot to the ferry line, so we'll actually have ferries. There we go. See, I told you I did this, guys. I mean, I really didn't build this whole episode beforehand. All I did, honestly, was just make sure that the paths can go underneath the bridges, and that's all I really tested because that's all I really cared about. It's just very odd that... <sighs> Alright, well, they can share this path. Oh my... Oh my gosh, that was annoying. Alright, so we have... We have two... We have two lines that are hooked up after all that. Now, oh, look at this. Okay, so they already pre-made the all right cool so they already pre-made the ferry line which works out really well for us through the canal oh my god city skylines you are not my friend today There we go. Alright, let me bring this back over here. There we go. Okay, so as you can tell that the boats can actually go through. So our boat depot can actually get boats over here. Now, I would never in my life want to take such a long ferry ride, but we just need it for the boat depot purposes to get the boats over here. Oh my gosh. This would be an extremely long boat ride. If you are somebody who's retired and has a lot of time on their hands to actually make, you know, to actually be on this ferry ride the entire way through, well, good for you. Uh, if you're working or have a family and can't be on a boat all day, well, this ferry line is not for you but this is I'm just showing you guys how to actually use the ferry lines um, you know it's, it's might not be the most efficient way to actually use them but you know it is what it is okay so we have all of our ferry lines actually sort of connected up now and we do have some flooding but that will take care of itself but um, as you can see our our canal is literally it's it's almost to 100 percent and everything's gone down river or flooded over here but that's okay that's gonna go away so what you need to do next is create actually create the ferry line so what we want is a ferry line that goes here to the other side of the city our major city center and back very simple very 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 simple now i do want to create a line that goes over here and then it's going to come over here to this lovely part of, of the city that's not built and I think that's still underwater no and guess what the shoreline moved so <laughs> that's cool that's really cool guys so as you can tell no it's still I don't get it we're gonna leave that there for now I don't 
I don't see this working for I don't see this working out because I see that this could be an issue, but whatever. It whatever. It's okay. Now I do want to try to create a a new line that goes over this way. I'm not sure how well this is going to work, but we can tell. We can check. And we'll go over Oh my god, this is basically a cruise. This is essentially going to be a cruise. I mean, I, this is going to be a really long ferry ride. All right, let's see how our ferries do. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh my God. I, I'm going to say that that ferry is probably a little stuck. So we're going to lower the, t there you go. We're going to add some water over here and there you go. Whoa! Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! Hey! Got out of there. There you go. That that should work. I know that's not. There it goes, and it fills in with water. And there you go. Sorry guys, that was pretty funny. All right. I just want to add this little part of our city center. Oh, we have a lot of boats. I mean, can you guys just chill out for two seconds? All right, I just wanted to do that and then connect it to the roads. Oh my God, look at... I need to look at how many ferries we have because this is probably insanely ridiculous. Like, look at... Oh my gosh. I, I'm pretty sure the ferries reproduced on their own. Oh my God. And we need that water to go down over there. Otherwise, that little bridge will annoy annoy the living daylights out of me. Anyways, um, so that is how you build the ferry lines with canals. Uh, is anybody even using the ferry lines? Well, so far, nobody. Oh, well, that would... This would actually make the ferry lines a little bit more efficient if people could actually get to them. I mean, who would have ever thunk that, ladies and gentlemen? We've had quite an episode today. Let me tell you, I have been on point with screwing everything up. So that is pretty much perfect. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add some bus lines to our little hub. And again, this is the Sunset Harbor DLC hub that I'm using. So just remember that. And we'll add bus line there. Do we have any other bus lines nearby? I know I have my bus hub over here. Let's snag the purple line. Gotcha, purple line. And then what's the other one? There's a there is a blue line that I'm snagging. We'll have it go over here. Perfect. So we have a couple bus lines going there. We have a couple ferry lines. I do want a ferry. I do want one more ferry line that goes just between here. Just it, it'll be like our suburbs ferry line. So let's go back and we'll just create one that goes from from here. While my SA Skylines game is saving, goes from here to here and back. There you go. So that is basically the ferry lines in a nutshell. 